Hello. Hi, Miss Rowling. I want to tell you that I'm happy to talk to you, to the greatest writer of our time without any exclusion. And I want to admit that I'm a big fan of yours work. Thank you. What you're doing. Thank you so much. That means that means the world. And I think that Ukraine could lead um, your part of Europe in that in that respect. I think if you, Ukraine sets the example going forward, that would be a wonderful thing. I wanted to talk um, uh, with you about the cancellation culture of Russia now. It's uh, loud. What else do you think the whole civilized world can do to put pressure on them? I know that in Russia you have banned local publishers for, from publishing your books, as I know, of course. Um, I think that uh, I, I'm not sure that story is accurate. I think that there, although that has been reported, uh, but we we are currently not proceeding in Russia ourselves mm -hmm. because um, out of solidarity with Ukraine, um, I'm not proceeding with certain um, business interests in Russia. Um, so, in fact, it would be me mm -hmm. not wanting to be affiliated with Russia mm -hmm. rather than the other way around. Maybe it's better um, to demand that Russians don't read your books at all, for, for us, I think. Did you? Yeah. yeah. Because it's, they did not deserve it. Well, they certainly didn't understand them. I, I heard that uh, you have read uh, Harry Potter to, uh, with Tchaikovsky's music. So uh, I, that is true. That is true. Mm -hmm. uh, well, partly, not always. There was some pop music too. I know, but now there's, there's a time when any Russian culture uh, should be under uh, surrounding. Should be uh, it should be really um, how to say um, we have to uh, look at it properly not to promote uh, Russian culture, including Tchaikovsky. And I know that you have heard that it's already banned in some, in some parts of uh, Europe now. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. I think that, um, yeah, pressure must be brought to bear on Russia culturally, economically. Um, I certainly support much stronger sanctions against Russia. Yeah, and, you know, by the way, but uh, I know the problem that Tchaikovsky is also gay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Joe, in the film, in the new film, Fantastic Beasts, and where, where to find them, uh, The Secret of Dumbledore, Russian actor yeah. Alexander Kuznetsov plays the role of Helmut. Unfortunately, it can no longer be cut out, but... Is it possible to impose any sanctions on him? Like, for example, it was a story with Johnny Depp. Oh, yes, um, Fantastic Beasts has been a very interesting experience. Um, I will certainly talk. I will certainly talk to people and see what we can do. I also have a request, cultural request. You know, Harry Potter has a scar on his forehead in the shape of the letter Z. You know what is it? Light, lightning bolts, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So is it possible to somehow remove this care due to the geopolitical situation? Maybe it's better to put the Ukrainian trident, it's our, uh, it's our sign of Ukraine, on his, uh, on his forehead, and it's good to make his cut hair as Ukrainian forelock. I will um, look at that. It might be... Um... It might be good for me to do something with that myself on social media, um, because I think that that would get into the newspapers. I didn't know they were doing that, but that's certainly something that I can address personally. Mm -hmm. You know, well, now uh, the, the situation is pretty hard for us. You know that there are still many fights around, the, especially on the east side of Ukraine. And you know that uh, your country also is supporting us. You know that I had mm -hmm. already a meeting with uh, your prime minister, Boris, and yeah. we already in uh, big touch with him. Uh, but especially I 
don't um, it doesn't matter but i see that he doesn't really as i think in my uh, humble opinion that he really understands uh, what is really going on in our country especially because it's like a kind of his pr yeah it's of course it is it is and uh, he's a conservative of course that's why yeah Does, exactly. uh, I always supported uh, uh, laborists, and uh, no, many. I had a good friendship with uh, uh, with Tommy Blair and uh, other people. So yeah. now, 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 uh, we are trying to find the ways how to uh, collaborate with the world's community, how to get more support, how to get more. Uh, military support uh, to, to our country and of course it's really important but what is also important for me is to know that uh, people who are not politicians they really support us they really feel what do we feel and especially like many famous writers many famous musicians and you know I'm also an actor in past I was an actor in the, yeah, maybe in the future. I hope I will take a part in a new movie about Harry Potter when especially you put, you put Ukrainian tree, uh, tridents on his, uh, for, for hats. Now you have, uh, uh, Boris. It's not a Churchill, of course. It's not Churchill. No, you're absolutely right. I think your yeah, view of Boris is entirely yeah. accurate. Mm, However, I, I am glad that we are sending you arms. I mean, I, you know, this, this is important and I'm, and I'm happy that that's happening, of course. I admit, I don't understand all these new trends myself. People from uh, idleness came up with uh, 30 types of sexes, changed their gender without understanding their consequences. Uh, it's exactly. especially terrible when children do that. How can we fight this? We need to open people's eyes to the fact that all this sex changes only to go to people for evil, but I don't know how to do it carefully. I'm trying to do it. I promise you I am trying to do it. I agree with you. The medicalization of children is a horror. It's a horror. And I have seen, because I've been in Romania, for example, and seen, I've seen what ideology can do to children in a medical context. And this, this is a particularly Western scandal. And I, I'm married to a doctor who thinks we're watching the biggest medical scan scandal of our generation. How, um, how, how do you see with, what kind of uh, gender has Boris? <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely a man. And his past history proves that he's definitely a man. <laughs> We are going to open book clubs all over the country and name them after you. Uh, and we also want to invite you to reach Harry Potter in front of the soldiers of the Azov Battalion. Uh, they have a public, uh, public club. Uh, they like, oh, yeah, they like to read a lot, especially German literature. Uh, just don't read them passages about half breeds they are nationalists and do not like such people <laughs> I, <laughs> understood i want to clarify where you are sending the money that lumus has collected the fact is that we are really like modern uh, weapons we want to buy a lot of weapons and missiles with your money to destroy russian troops i hope you are uh, all of for it so. <laughs> i think that uh yeah Well, we'll look after the kids, but I'm, I really want Ukraine to have all the arms it needs. And we will deal with refugees and children after the Russian leave our land. You must understand yeah. that the weapons are more important now, but we cannot advertise it. I can say it, I can say in the prayer that the money was spent on children, children and the, I, yeah. And we will yeah. buy I, and low I, missiles with them in the UK. So let's do that. Okay, I understand completely. And by the way, I ordered that our fighters write uh, Ab 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 Abdra Kedavra. Abdra Kedavra. Yeah, yeah. On exactly. The, on the missiles that we will launch at Donetsk and Lugansk. So how do you like this joke? I love the joke. I love the joke. Finally, really tell, finally tell me a, a secret. I'm interested as, as your fan. Is Dumbledore gay? 
I won't tell anyone and who did he sleep with. Well, I always, I always, I said in 2007 that I did, I always saw Dumbledore as gay. That's mm -hmm. the truth. I, in 2007, and it was a big scandal at the time that I said it. So yeah, I still, yeah, uh, that's the way I see him. I mean, so, it's an old man. He's an old man when we see him in the book. So, you know, his, his love life is no longer very important. But yeah, that's how I saw him. I will never tell this to anyone. So <laughs> hopefully not with a trans transgender person. <laughs> <laughs> This has been such a pleasure. Mm. Let me let me introduce my uh, my team. Uh, it's a. Uh, You know that we also have a not traditional, we use not traditional, uh, traditional methods and we um, try to uh, involve people who usually not uh, far away from magic. And I know some uh, people who are some like uh, um, wizards, we know them, it's like, you know, people, it's... it's Uh, I have my, I called my own army order of the Ukrainian phonics. I have uh, people, it's our, uh, how, how to say, uh, hereditary witches uh, that uh, they usually has a special spell words how to help our army. And if you don't mind, I can uh, show you them. If you Definitely. agree, just, I would love let, to. okay, just let me show them. Вы выходите, есть кто на линии? Oh, it's here, here they are. Hi, hello, wonderful to meet you. It's a hereditary witches, and especially like they are real, they are real wizards. I can see that. I can tell. I'm qualified to say. They want to say to you something. Бабушки, скажите что-нибудь от своего сердца. Dear Джоан, my name is Ham Ione Granger. My friends and I are hereditary sorcerers and we conjure So ours, army wins. Can you help us? Say some spell to help us. Oh, shit, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm приглашаю вас на борщ. А сейчас мы вам споем They will sing to you from our hearts. From our country. Давайте, бабушки, запивайте. I love it. I absolutely love it. Bravo. Бабушки, вы понравились? Бабушки, вы понравились. Спасибо вам большое. Thank you, George. She, uh, they all love you. Very, very. Feeling is mutual. The feeling is I love you. I love you. I love you. Love you. Okay, thank you, Joe. I know that one of the, my big friends, uh, uh, they are writers. They are writers, but they are, of course, they are Russians, but they are my favorite writers. It's Vovan and Lexus. Can you oh, yeah. tell tell them hello, Vovan and Lexus? Well, of course, of course, I will. Yeah. No, you can say uh, you can oh, say sorry, Vovan and okay. Lexus. Vovan and Lexus. Hi. Vovan and Lexus. Yeah, hello. they are also writers. Okay, <laughs> thank you. <laughs>